Yasodhara, Pali, Yasodhara was the former wife of Gautama Buddha before he left his home to become a sramana the mother of Rahula, and the sister of Devadatta. She later became a bhikkhuni and is considered an arahata. Life Yasodhara was the daughter of King Supabuddha, and Amida, sister of the Buddha's father, King Suddhodana. She was born on same day in the month of Vishaka as Prince Gautama. Her grandfather was Anyana Akolia chief, her father was Supabuddha and her mother, Amida, came from a Shakya family. The Shakya and the Kolia were branches of the Adika or Ikshvaku dynasty. There were no other families considered equal to them in the region and therefore members of these two royal families married only among themselves. She was wedded to her cousin, the Shakya prince Siddhartha, when they were both sixteen. At the age of twenty-nine, she gave birth to their only child, a boy named Rahula. On the seventh night of his birth, the prince left the palace. Yasodhara was devastated and overcome with grief. Buddha left his home at night for enlightenment, without letting sleeping Yashodhara know about him. In the morning when she woke up she didn't see him. Hearing that her husband was leading a holy life, she emulated him by removing her jewelry, wearing a plain yellow robe and eating only one meal a day. Although relatives sent her messages to say that they would maintain her, she did not take up those offers. Several princes sought her hand but she rejected the proposals. Throughout his six-year absence, Princess Yasodhara followed the news of his actions closely. When the Buddha visited Kapilavasta after enlightenment, Yasodhara did not go to see her former husband but asked Rahula to go to Buddha to seek inheritance. For herself, she thought, Surely if I have gained any virtue at all the Lord will come to my presence. In order to fulfill her wish, Buddha came into her presence and admired her patience and sacrifice. Some time after her son Rahula became a novice monk, Yasodhara also entered the order of monks and nuns and within time attained the state of an arahat. She was ordained as bhikkhuni with the 500 women following Mahapajapati Gotami that first established the bhikkhuni order. She died at 78, two years before Buddha's parinirvana death. Topic. Legends In the Chinese, Fu Ben Xing Ji Jing the collective sutra of the Buddha's past acts, Yashodhara meets Siddhartha Gautama for the first time in a previous life, when as the young Brahmin Sumita, he is formally identified as a future Buddha by the Buddha of that era, Dipankara Buddha. Waiting in the city of Paduma for Dipankara Buddha, he tries to buy flowers as an offering but soon learns that the king already bought all the flowers for his own offering. Yet, as Dipankara is approaching, Sumita spots a girl named Sumita or Bhadra holding seven lotus flowers in her hands. He speaks to her with the intention of buying one of her flowers, but she recognizes at once his potential and offers him five of the lotuses if he would promise that they would become husband and wife in all their next existences. In the thirteenth chapter of the Lotus Sutra, Yasodhara receives a prediction from Gautama Buddha as does Mahapajapati. Topic. Names The meaning of the name Yasodhara Sanskrit from Yasas, glory, splendor, plus Dara, bearing, from the verbal root Dhri, to bear, support, is bearer of glory. The names she has been called besides Yasodhara are, Yasodhara Theri Dayen Yasodhara, Bimbadevi, Bhadakakana and Rahulamata mother of Rahula. In the Pali Canon, the name Yasodhara is not found, there are two references to Bhadakakana. See also Thero Pamamsambhava Women in Buddhism <laughs>